Good morning, everyone. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. It is about 8 a.m. in the morning and today is move-in day. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Lena. I am a rising sophomore at St. Lawrence University. I am double majoring in English and Francophone studies, hopefully, and I will be a CA or community assistant this year. That is why I'm moving in early. This is my move-in day vlog and I'm hoping to take you along with me for the journey. It's going to be a bit of a whirlwind due to COVID restrictions, so we'll see what that brings. I'll just do a quick outfit of the day. I'm just wearing a tank top from Reebok, some Nike shorts, and some Birkenstocks. Um, I really suggest that you bring some athleisure or um, clothes that you're completely comfortable in and can wear because um, it can get really hot and we have to move in completely by ourselves this year so I need to be able to move and get up and down the stairs because I have a lot of stairs I need to climb. So let's get started. for the bad camera work here but this was basically when I got in my room just a quick snapshot of before so it is about 3 30 in the afternoon and this is what your dorm room looks like when you have to lug everything up by yourself I'm just about to start organizing things so here's a quick sneak peek of what my room looks like my room is a literal mess um, I have everything everywhere because I had to dump all my storage bins out and give them back to my parents. This is my lovely view from the window. And then I have a bed with like a million things on it. Yes, I am not this messy, but it appears that I am pretty messy. So I'm gonna work on cleaning this up. I think I'm going to sit on a time lapse and get some things done. I won't be able to get everything done because they did not loft my bed as I requested. Um, and I have no idea how to loft it by myself. So we'll see what I can do. So my room is still a mess, but I have changed up the layout a little bit. Um, I've added my adorable plants to the windowsill. I'm not sure how many will be staying here, but I love them so much. The three on the left are my new plants this year, and the two on the right I had last year in my dorm room. Um, they, I love them so much. Hopefully this one and this one will bloom at some point. And then I think I'm gonna put my mirror here, but I'll hang it up on the wall so it's taller. And my bed's here, and I'm planning on having my pillows and everything down there, and we'll organize that. And this is just where I am at. So yeah, I'm gonna put my clothes in my closet, and then maybe make my bed that I've said I'm gonna do that 100 times. 
and I'm gonna make my bed. Um, my bookshelf does not look as good as I want it to yet, but hopefully it will get there. Um, and we're gonna have supper in like an hour and a half or so. I need to go find the people in my family unit, which are the people I am allowed to eat supper with because obviously you have to take off your mask to have supper. So I'm gonna go try to find them in a little bit. But for now, hopefully I'll finally get around to making my bed because that will make my room look a lot more put together. I'm a little nervous when they need to come loft my bed because a lot needs to be done. So I've put on the protective layer for my bed. Um, and now I'm going to make it. So we'll see how that goes. This is just like an allergen, bed bug, etc. protective layer. And now I have to put the mattress pad on. We'll see how this goes. So hot. So we have a problem. I don't really know if you can see them, but if you look closely, you can see those little bugs. It appears that the plants that I brought into my room have brought in a swarm of bugs. So my mom suggested spraying my um, isopropyl alcohol on them, and we'll see if that helps, but bugs in my dorm room are not exactly something I want. I have no idea where anyone in my family unit is, so I'm headed to supper right now by myself. We'll see how it goes, and then I can go back to working on the room. So I just went and got my supper for the night. I actually didn't really see anyone that I knew, so I just went and got it by myself. Might think I'm trying to be healthy right now with just some organic salad, but I swear I'm not. I just don't understand how the dining hall works yet under all these restrictions. And salad was the first thing they asked me if I wanted. So here we are with salad. Hopefully it fills me up enough. I got chickpeas and quinoa and stuff like that, but let's eat. And then I'm gonna continue to work on my mess of a room. And pardon all of the driving in the background. There's all the go-kart stuff. Oh, I just finished my supper and quick environmental question, talk, comment, something. Um, if everyone has to eat off this and not normal plates and silverware, I get that this is recyclable, but like, that's a lot of waste. Cause even recycling is not the best thing. It's better to just reuse. So everyone's just using these cups and these things, and also we know not everyone's gonna throw them away. So this is a little concerning to me. Um, as I get to know the dining hall better under all these restrictions, maybe I'll figure out a way to cut down on that, but here we are. Also, I have this cup because we weren't allowed to fill our water bottles. We can only take a cup and fill our water bottles. So I figured I might as well fill the cup I used to fill my water bottle to get a little more water, and here we are. So now that supper is over, I'm going to go back to work. I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna start working on. Um, I know that I can put the trunk under the bed, but I am not sure if anything else is gonna fit under the bed while it's still not lofted. So I think I'm just gonna to continue to organize and get rid of as much of the clutter as I can. So the lighting in here is pretty bad right now, but I have successfully done quite a few things, but I am really tired from this long day, so I'm gonna clear off my bed, go to sleep, and I think I'm gonna continue this vlog tomorrow so you can see more things that I'm doing. 
It is the next day. I have just finished a really long day of training for my position as a CA. I wasn't able to do much in my room because my bed still needs to be lofted, but I was able to get my rug down and organize a couple more things. So I'll just show you what the room's looking like right now. I was able to consolidate all the things that are will eventually go under my bed um, over here in this corner by the door. Um, the blue bin is actually full with all my wall decor because as you can tell, I've not decorated any of my walls yet. So that is my next step, but I don't want to decorate until my bed has been lofted because I want to know how high to put up the decorations. Um, my dresser is still a mess, but the great news is I finally got to put my rug down and it's actually under all the furniture. So that's great. Um, and my plants are living their best life. And the best news of it all is the bugs are gone. So I am so excited about that. If you enjoyed this move in day vlog, please subscribe to my channel and give this video a like. I will be posting more college vlogs as well as sit down college videos and of course my beloved book content. So if you have any video recommendations, please leave them down in the comments below. Also, if you have any questions, please leave them down in the comments below. I love answering questions. I am so glad you decided to watch this video. Thank you so much and I hope to see you all next week.